we're in the beautiful Corzal town in Belize. It's a hot sunny day. Uh, the breeze is blowing. We're here on the beach side. This is called Miami Beach. <laughs> That's right, it's called Miami Beach in Corozal town. Look at that beautiful water. Here with my grandmother hanging out, they got little palapas all over the place so people can sit down and relax. People come here a lot on the weekends beat the heat, swim in the sea, uh, cool off from breeze. They usually bring appetizers. They make, theirself, they make themselves uh, cheese dips, ceviche, stuff like that. And their ice box full of beers. And they have a good day, have some fun in the sun. Can't beat it, it's beautiful. So I hope you guys can hear me. I don't have the mics on because we're gonna hit the water in a little bit. We're gonna go take a little dip in the sea. Look at that, it's beautiful. Not too rough, just calm enough. And it is nice. And if for those of you who uh, you come out and you don't want to cook appetizers, you don't want to bring your drinks, or you're just cruising around the beachside and you decide, let's stop for a bit. There's places like this, it's called Pancho's Drink House over there. And uh, it's all food, drinks, that you can buy and come enjoy here on the beach side. We're gonna go check them out right now. Let's go see what they have. This is Pancho's drink house right here on the beach. Nice little place, nice little hut. You see the little cabanas are on that side, they're on that side. They even got music playing, but we got that off right now because you know, copyright problems. And uh, people who don't wanna bring their own appetizers or drinks, they come here and they've got whole bunch of mixed drinks see the drink when you hear frozen drinks pina coladas baileys mudslides uh, they got all the top shelf liquors bucanas black label jack daniels all your favorite belkin beers there's even more on the back even non-alcoholic drinks for your kids right frappes smoothies they've got uh, batches which are uh, shakers all different drinks that's good and then there's food also. You got your appetizers, botanas, nuggets, salads, burgers, wings. Uh, it's on the one side, but yeah, it's it's amazing. So I got myself a land shark here and uh, a water for my grandmother. She doesn't feel like drinking. How can you come to this beach and not drink? It's nice inside. Uh, I'll put the address to this place in the description and all of that info in case you need it. And we're gonna head back to the beach. We got. A nice ice cold land shark and the water for my grandmother as you saw earlier she's over there looks like she's gonna dip her feet in the water <laughs> that's fun I'm gonna take a little sip oh that's good and uh, we're gonna hit the water let's see how if it's cold or not her way. It was a meter? Okay. Let's see. Got a little ways down here. I got my water shoes on because uh, you never know. Sometimes you get drunks who are uh, they're just <laughs> put it and uh, they break bottles and stuff sometimes in the water. So I don't want to cut myself. Let's try this out. Ooh, that is cold. Not too cold, it's like just the right temperature with this heat. It is perfect. Wow. Ugh. Little rocky, but not bad. Not bad at all. Let's see where we can go. Go nice and slowly because we don't want to fall on these rocks. We don't want to fall. Whoa. Nice and slow. And here we go. It's deeper here. I'm not sure how much deeper. So let's try to do this slowly just in case uh, 
I don't know how deep it goes. <laughs> I want to go down, but I don't know if it's super deep or is it shallow enough? Looks like it's right there. It's not deep at all. Okay. Let's take the risk. Let's take the risk. Grab onto the... Oh, it's not deep at all. <laughs> I'm scared for nothing. Oh, but it's nice. It's cold. It's cold. It's not ice cold, but it's cold enough to keep the heat. You look around. There's more bars on that side. Uh, some restaurants slash bars over there. So in case you don't want appetizers, you want a full full meal, or you want to go eat for lunch with your family. I did come to the beachside. Look at that. It's nice. Ah, uh, I haven't been in this in the sea here in Belize in Corozal in I don't know like ten years, but it is good. Let's go under and wet our head. Woo. Very salty. Very f nice. Oh. Like I said, on weekends, there's people out here swimming, families, drinking, having snacks, and cooling down. It's really, really nice. <laughs> uh, it actually gets pretty deep pretty fast, as you see right there and we're already up to my chest here there's also a boat ramp there so I guess that's why that's uh where the boats go uh, the water it's not uh, blue it's not green either it's usually more brownish because uh, in Corozal we have a mix from that side the water from the ocean comes in and from this side the water from the Belize River comes in. It's called the New River. So it's usually a mix between uh, sort of greenish to brown. All depends on water from which side is uh, flowing more. If it's from the river, it's brown. If it's from the ocean, it's more greenish. You also got to be careful sometimes because of that. Because it is a river, sometimes the crocodiles from the river come up over looking for food. So. You always got to keep an eye out, but this is nice. Oh yeah, this is relaxing. It's been a while. It's so hot out here. It's like uh, 29 to 30 degrees Celsius daily. Real hot, especially if you're from Canada, right? <laughs> this is the weather people are starting to get heat strokes and dying from, but it's nice. I'm going to enjoy this a bit and go out and have some more beer. Thanks for watching, hit that subscribe button and see you on more adventures in beautiful Belize.